That's right, everyone. We are back at SeaWorld. We are here for a look at the Pipeline Surf Coaster construction, as well as take a look at the 2024 project over by Antarctica. So let's go. Let's have some fun. That's Manta. There's a flyby. Welcome aboard the SeaWorld Sky Tower. For the comfort and safety of everyone, we ask that you please remain seated at all times. Thank you. Welcome aboard the SeaWorld Sky Tower. As you take your ride up to a height of 300 feet, we thought it would be helpful to share some SeaWorld tips that might make your day even more enjoyable. For your own safety, please stay in your seats for the entire ride and no smoking, please. Did you know that SeaWorld has rescued and rehabilitated more than 39,000 animals? None of this would be possible without the continued support of our partner agencies park guests like you, as well as people across the globe taking action to protect these amazing animals and their habitats. Our teams are on call 24-7, 365 days a year, partnering with multiple government agencies, conservationists, zoological facilities, and others to rescue and help animals in need of our care, always with the goal of rehabilitating them and returning them to the wild. Well, we're just about 300 feet up now, and from here you can see from miles and miles. As the cabin rotates, keep an eye open for a lush, tropical oasis right across the street from SeaWorld. That's Discovery Cove, where you can snorkel with rays and exotic fish, relax on a beautiful beach, and even swim alongside dolphins. To the east, also across the street from SeaWorld, you'll find Aquatica. Our water park hosts the most water slides in Orlando. This amazing park has been voted the number one outdoor water park in the USA. Visit the information counter today to see how you can experience Discovery Cove and Aquatica. and the oceans they call home. Your visit is a chance for you to play a part in protecting our planet. Each ticket and each experience helps fund wildlife rescue and rehabilitation efforts, habitat protections, and ocean health initiatives. Our mission is to see it here and save it there, from park to planet. 
To find more information on any of our award-winning events, guided tours, educational programs, or restaurant reservations, visit us online at SeaWorld.com, download the SeaWorld app, or stop by the guest information counter located near the park's front entrance. We hope that you have enjoyed your ride aboard the SeaWorld Sky Tower. Be sure to check your seats for any belongings and watch your step as you exit the cabin. Thanks for joining us and have a great day here at SeaWorld. As I mentioned in my previous construction of the video to access a specific point preserve, We'll go through sea lion and otter. Okay, that's the work of the twenty twenty four Antarctica project. here from the Sky Tower and the area that you're working is huge. Alrighty. We do know at some point uh, Kraken will be uh, impacted by the construction. We're just not sure when that will be. Most likely when they start putting in the tracks and well, and or supports. So. We'll find out. Still a process of clearing the land, so nothing's actually gotten started yet. Just clearing the land. And yep, walls are still here. Over what was the other ice cream parlor. I'm not sure what's going happening here, but the wall's been up for a very long time. Already.
to say I love the mural on the, uh, I guess that's mural, <laughs> on the side of the maintenance barn for pipeline. Very cool. And there is a train in the station. Hopefully we'll see some test runs today. Yeah, looks like the new walkway from Flamecraft is uh, completed. A lot of workers in sight. Looks like they're putting in landscaping. And some other work going on. SeaWorld has not set an actual date yet, but they did say it will open in May. So, we're just waiting for which day? Which if I had to take a guess, it'd be Memorial Day weekend, but that's just a guess. I was hoping to see some testing, but uh, there's nothing happening right now. Of course, it is early in the afternoon. They may do it later on this evening. Basically, they'll wait till after I leave. Looks like the main this barn on this side has also got some murals on it. That can be seen from inside the park. Pipeline's looking good. So the pathway is in, all these sections of it. Soon I imagine previews will probably get started. Probably two or three weeks away yet, but uh, we're getting close. Okay, that's going to do it for this video. We have some weather moving in, so I'm going to go ahead and call it. So, I uh, hope that you enjoyed a look at Pipeline, the surf coaster, which is opening next month in May, and a look at the 2024 Antarctica project. So, we'll see you next time. So, until then, bye now.